I will always remember New Year's Eve 1999 here at this garden with you people. We, uh, we took the tour to Times Square last night, which was somehow anticlimactic. It was not nearly the big deal that the, the 6 o'clock news was making it out to be. There, there was plywood over the Disney store, which of course warmed my heart, and the, the members of the Church of Stop Shopping that were at 42nd and 7th Street and saw the entire Disney store plywooded up. We took some pride in that. <laughs> Hallelujah. We've, we've <laughs> we, we thought that we might have had some small contribution to that decision, praise be. <laughs> we've, uh, we have gone in 28 times into the Disney store over the last two years and have gently confronted uh, shoppers. The Disney Store has been advertising for the last 10 months that it is the host to America of the millennium. Usually we've dressed like tourists and edged up alongside of shoppers and just started talking about what was in front of us. There are behind that plywood 5,000 Minnie Mouses dressed up in drag like the Statue of Liberty. Reverend Billy is not theater, not religion, and not politics, but he's one of those things at any given point in the, in the evening of a Church of Stop Shopping ritual, he comes close to being one of those things. I've always loved preachers, I, I, even the homophobic, uh, you know, racist uh, southern televangelists are marvelous rhetoricians and they, they have they have a they have a powerful instrument what I'm thinking of is why not use that instrument and, but use it for right value <laughs> the millennium in Times Square is pretty much an international embarrassment <laughs> you know it's Rudy's little showcase it's it's pretty much just embarrassing we're becoming anywhere USA we're, we're losing this purchase we had on uniqueness the millennium could have been a moment to, to sit and grok about immense, vast time. But did you notice, like about six months ago, that became nothing that we considered anymore? Because by that time, for most of us, the discourse being driven by advertising, well, the millennium just became a bunch of products. It became the Mall of America. But why are they welding those manhole covers shut? Why did they say millennium, millennium, especially the Disney company, for like 18 months? And then when the millennium comes and it's going to be an actual experience, we're going to actually cross that border into, into that, that vast thing out there, all of a sudden, tight asshole whitey, yeah. <laughs> weld the manhole covers shut. Make everyone move 10 blocks because of one little package. They're afraid. Turning everything into products is about fear being adolescent and militaristic and, and just expanding like this guy Donald and Rudy, it's adolescent, it's, it's, it's full of fear. And that's why we have the power. I, I don't see these life forms being full of fear. They're proud and spiritual and growing. They have a trust that we can adopt for ourselves. Bless you children. Thank you for inviting me to talk to you this morning. I'm, I'm honored to be here. Thank you.